This is Rahil, and I want to give my reaction to Kendrick Lamar's The Heart Part 4. Um, it's alright. It's okay. Um, it was kind of light, man. Like, you know, some people, like my, my boy hit me up. He was raving about it. And, you know, it's alright. It's okay. Beat, beat goes one way, then switches up. He's telling folks, you know, get ready for me. I'm coming. April 7th, you better be ready for me, etc., etc. However, um, I personally like the heart part four. I mean, excuse me, the heart part two off his overly dedicated uh, mixtape. The heart part two, he slaughters that beat. It's actually a beat by, um, I think it's off the roots. Uh, they did like some, like some type of mixtape where they did a uh, dedication to Dilla. So they remade and replayed a lot of his beats and stuff like that. Anyway, he kills that. The heart part two. Check out the heart part two. It's better than part four. Part four did not get me amped up for another Kendrick Lamar album. I do want to hear the next Kendrick Lamar album. However, however, his bars, to me, they didn't punch. Maybe it was the mixing of the track, but they just didn't punch, man. However, I'm still a fan of Kendrick. The hard part four was aight. It was light. I want you to come harder, Kendrick. If you're going to come hard and then be direct, say people's names. Because it seemed like you was alluding to certain people. I'm not going to even try to dissect who you're talking about because I know um, <laughs> people like Big Sean, even uh, Drake, some of them have taken shots and not said your name at you. And you've kind of been jabbing back and forth with some of these different people. So, um, my reaction to it is, it's aight. It's light. Check out part two of The Heart by Kendrick Lamar. Peace.